Here are the 10 best things about living in the Wenatchee Valley. Number one is the weather. In Wenatchee, North Central Washington, we have four perfect seasons. Summer, fall, winter, and spring. The spring's beautiful with the apple, uh, apple blossom and sage hills and the balsam root and the, all the flowers. Beautiful weather, 60, 70 degrees. You'll start getting outside, going on hikes and bikes and getting out there, doing your gardening. You'll absolutely love it. The summertime, the heat comes and it's it can be hot. I gotta be honest, sometimes in August, it's so hot you can't even go outside in the 100, 110 degree weather. But for the most part, it cools down at night. So you can go out and barbecue and have people over, see you have some amazing sunsets in the summer, or get up early in the morning and get your exercise in and you're walking in in your outdoor recreation. But you're gonna get a lot of sun. So if you love the sun, you're gonna get that in the Wenatchee Valley. In fact, there's 320 days of sunshine throughout the year. So it's rare to have overcast, it's rare to have rain, but when it does rain, it's it really does rain and it can get quite windy, but it doesn't happen that often. And you're actually, it's a pleasant surprise because you're like, oh, finally we get some rain, right? You know you're kind of a, a Wenatcheeite when you're like, well, we need some rain here. <laughs> it's a good thing. Winter time, snow comes. Fall, fall colors are absolutely gorgeous. And the winter time we get snow. And that's another reason you want to live in Wenatchee. So number two is we got Mission Ridge. We got Mission Ridge, a ski hill, downhill ski hill with four lifts. It's well known throughout Northwest. In fact, lo lots of avid skiers and snowboarders, uh, snow snowboarders go there because the, s the snow is really light and it stays really dry. We don't get a ton of snow, but when we do, it stays and people will absolutely love it. It's a small hill, right, but with big lifts and you're gonna love it. It's like the second highest peak uh, as far as a ski hill in Washington State. I think Crystal's only the higher higher elevation wise. So you go way up like 6,700 feet and you have amazing views of the valley. You're gonna love it. Bomber Bowl is one of the most famous runs there where you gotta go through and they call it Bomber Bowl because there was like a bomber that crashed there and there's a wing on the run and the, the lifts are great, great place to go. Number three, our utilities are inexpensive. It's cheap to live here. Now, I'm in real estate, housing prices, depending on where you're coming from, can be a little bit more because it's super desirable to be here. But the power, we have some of the cheapest power in the nation. We have hydroelectric dams up and down the Columbia River, which runs right between East Wenatchee and Wenatchee. And so that really abundant renewable resource is provided to us at a really low cost. So you could have a 3,000 square foot house and be electric forced air heat electric AC, and your bill could be $100 a month, sometimes less. So it's really affordable. And we have irrigation, a lot of homes have irrigation water. So you get to water your lawn during the summer, right? For $100, $200 flat fee, $300 flat fee, right? As much as you want. Well, as much as you can use, there's actually a limit, but it's an abundant resource here. So we have water, we have power, right? And we have really good utilities and you're gonna love that. And number four is the location. North Central Washington is central. It's, you got Highway 97 coming through and that goes from Leavenworth. You can get to Leavenworth in 20 minutes. You can go up to Lake Chelan in 30 minutes, right? You can easily head east to Spokane or head west to Seattle. So it's a great central location where you have tons of recreation, tons of things to do, but you can also go commute and leave and have some vacations or visit family or friends in the bigger cities. Horizon, Alaska Air, actually fly into East Wenatchee Pingborn Airport. So we actually have an airport here that has an airline where you can commute directly to Seattle in 25 minutes, a 25 minute flight, you're in Seattle and from Seattle, it's a gateway to wherever you wanna go. So if you're going to Hawaii or down, down to California, wherever you want, you can get there really quickly. You don't necessarily have to drive your car over the passes to Seattle. But if you do wanna drive over to Seattle, two and a half hours, you're there on good weather. So it's a great location for that. Number five is the medical facilities. Being centrally located, Confluence and Columbia Valley have great medical facilities. So if you need care or assistance or as, as we start aging, you have great access to doctors and medical facilities. It's really great. A lot of people move here because of that. Number six, water, water recreation. We got the Columbia River fantastic river where you can go fishing, you can go boating. There's boat launches down on the, down in town, multiple state parks along the river. 
the PUD, the Schland PUD has parks that you can enjoy. And it's so awesome because they take care of these parks. They're beautiful. They have, they have uh, park equipment for your kids to play on and you can get access to the river. It's cool. So if you like, I see people stand up paddle boarding on the river. There's a crew club, a rowing club. People go out there and they do, they're in their schools and, they're, and they're, they're rowing on the river in the morning. And then you got the water sports. So people are fishing, they're water skiing and they're wakeboarding and all of the above. So it's really cool. And even if you don't do water sports like myself, I really don't. I love just looking at the river. It's beautiful, it's gorgeous. And 30 minutes away is a 52 mile long lake, Lake Chelan. It's pristine, it's high mountain, it's gorgeous. You'll love going there too. We've got the Wenatchee River for rafting, fishing. Well, you can't fish it, but you got rafting there and you got all these little creeks and streams. So water is abundant, it's, it's absolutely gorgeous. Number seven, trails. We have some of the best trail systems in the state, in the Wenatchee Valley. Just on the outside of Wenatchee, up on the hill is called Sage Hills. Sage Hills is kind of owned by the Schland Douglas Land Trust, PUD, and some other public entities and private entities. But they, there's a trail system where you, it's multi-use. So you can walk, you can, you can hike, you can trail run, you can ride your mountain bike out there. You can even bring your horse on a lot of those trails. So it's multi-use, so know the rules when you go out there and know the etiquette, but you'll love it because there's wildflowers out there, there's tons of nature, there's tons of animals, you'll never know what you're gonna see, it's really cool. You'll see a deer one day, you might see a coyote, you might see a, you might even see a snake. I've seen some snakes out there. People freak out, but they're okay. This is, we're in the wild here, we're actually in nature, but you're right there in town, literally. You can get there out your back door when you live here. You can just ride your bike or just walk to the trail systems it's really, really cool. Sage Hills connects from uh, Canyon Number no. 2 all the way up to Horse Lake Road. You can go up to Horse Lake. This is a great place to go. Great trailhead right there. But there's, that's just not it. I mean, there's trails everywhere. Mission Ridge, up in Leavenworth, there's trails. You could probably live here for 50 years, go on a hike every, every month for 50 years and not do the same hike. I'm telling you, you will always have a place to go and you'll find your go-to trails and absolutely love it. Not only that, but we have paved trails. So along the river, it's called the Apple Capital Trail System. And it's about 10 to 12 miles, and it goes from bridge to bridge. So there's a south bridge and a north bridge that connect East Wenatchee and Wenatchee. You can literally walk, hike, run, bike, a paved trail all the way around it. It's really cool. People do it all the time. It's safe, and it's enjoyable. It's great for training. It's great for just getting out there. Now, it doesn't stop there. That 10, that 10 mile loop, 12 mile loop, actually also extends up to the dam. So they go, it goes up to the Rocky Reach Dam on the East Wenatchee side. That's another five miles of paved, beautiful trail system that goes up there. So now you're looking at 10, 15 miles, 20 miles round trip. And it also goes down to Hydro Park, down south towards Rock Island. So you have this cool system all up and down the Columbia River that you'll enjoy. Number eight is Pipus Market in downtown Wenatchee. So you want a little bit of a vibe, kind of some, some trendy culture, creativity, we have it downtown Wenatchee. We got shops, we got salons, we got restaurants, we got wineries, cideries, all downtown, and it all connects down to Pipus Market. Pipus Market is this really cool market down on the river where they have shops and vendors and restaurants. You'll really love it. It's a great place to go. And they have farmer's markets on the weekends. They have events happening there. It's a really place, great place to go. Me and my family love to go there just when we need something to do. We always know if we want something to do, we'll go to Pybus, we'll find something, right? And when people come to visit us, every time we go to Pybus, at least once to one of the restaurants down there. So you definitely wanna check that out. Number nine is probably the best thing about Wenatchee and the Wenatchee Valley is it's a small town but it has big city amenities. So we have a Home Depot, we have a Lowe's, we have a Costco, we have a Walmart. So you can do all your shopping here, right? And you can get access to everything you can in a big city. We have a mall and we have a, down, we have a couple downtown. So that's really cool. So we have that, that infrastructure in place, but we have a small town. So we have great schools, 
right? There's a number of elementary schools, middle schools, there's a high school, Wenatchee High School, and there's also an East Wenatchee High School. So there's two bigger high schools, public schools, and there's private schools that you can choose from too. So depending if you have kids or grandkids, there's places for them to go, choices to have. And with a small town, they have really cool events, right? There's always these committees going on, good, a, a strong rotary club, a strong chamber club. You got the, the rack. Uh, uh, athletic center, a YMCA. So you have all these small town things and events going on all the time. School sports, whether it's you know middle school, club, volleyball, little league baseball, all these things. And you'll see these things happening as you're in Wenatchee, right? There's always these little events going on, soccer clubs and things, and it gives you that great feel that you're part of a, a cool small community. And number 10 is events. We have the Town Toyota Center. This is this really big event where we have the Wenatchee Wild. It's a hockey team, like a semi-pro hockey team, but they also have, you know, entertainers come in and big events, right? Where they come in and you can go see some, um, some artists or some music events, some comedy shows, some bigger, you know, like, like motocross they have in there, rodeos they'll have in there sometimes. And then we have the Performing Arts Center. Right downtown is a Performing Arts Center. It's a cool, cool community, Numerica Arts Center, where they'll have plays, they'll have like, um, they'll have bands come in, orchestras come in, they'll have community plays that will happen every single year. So you can go in there and, and get some art and get some music. Not only that is if you go up north to, or go up to Leavenworth, they have the Sleepy Owl Theater. So there's lots of culture and music and, and things to get into in Wenatchee too. So all in all, those are the top biggest and best things about Wenatchee Valley. There's so much more about us and I want you guys to learn more. And so if you are thinking about relocating to our area, the Nick McLean Real Estate Group, we're the relocation specialist. We help 70% of the people that we've helped come from different areas all across America, even Canada, and sometimes internationally. But for the most part, it's, it's Washingtonians, Oregon, Oregonians, and Californians and things. So you're moving to the area. And you want a local expert that knows these things. Because the, depending on your interest level, we can help find the right house in the right location so you can maximize the best things about Wenatchee. So if it's, if it's trail running or hiking, we can, we can find you the right location for that. If it's skiing or snow sports or cross country skiing, skiing, we know where to go and where to live. So you can really maximize it to, to the best of ability. So, so find our number, give us a call, and we'll help you relocate.